Hi, good afternoon, everyone. Okay. Uh, so, Wanji, today we don't have any voice voice chat session. So, I make the recording for you. Okay, if you can refer to this recording to do your exercise later. Okay. So today we are going to learn about the two D shape. Okay. Okay. Last week we have learned about the three D shape. So this week we learn about the two D shape. Okay. Look at the sentence here. 2D shapes exist on the flat faces of the 3D shape. That means we can combine the 2D shape to create the 3D shape. Okay, now look at the first one. Okay, now look at the first picture here. Okay, look at the girl. The girl is holding, what is this? Okay, the girl is holding the cube. Okay, so... If we look at the cube, we can find a 2D shape of the square. Okay, this one we call square. Okay, so that's mean from the cube. Uh, from the cube, we can we can find the square shape. Or the combination of the square shape can create a cube. Okay, now look at the boy. Okay, the boy is holding a cone. Cone is a 3D shape. From the cone, we can find the shape circle. So that means circle can create the cone shape. Okay, that's the circle. Okay, next one. Look at the girl. The girl is holding the pyramid. From the pyramid, we can find the shape triangle. And the last one is the girl is holding the cuboid. From the cuboid, we can find a rectangle shape. So for today, you will learn about the 2D shapes. There are four 2D shapes here. Square, circle, triangle. And the last one is rectangle. Okay. The last week, the 3D shape that you have learned last week, we have six altogether. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have cone. We have cylinder. We have cube. We have cuboid. We have sphere. What else? Pyramid. Okay. Okay, next one. Okay, so now you want to look at this one. We will look at the detail of the 2D shape or the character of the 2D shape. Okay. We start with the shape square. Okay, look at the square here, the red square. I am square. Okay, this is we call corner, the pointed one or the sharp one. Okay, for the 2D shapes, we call it corner. Or if we have more than one corner, we put S at the back. For the 3D shape, we don't call it corner. We call it we can, we call it vertex or vertices. That's the different different words but the same meaning. Okay, so how many corners we have for the square? One, two, three, four. So there are four corners. How about this one? This one we call the straight side. Okay, one straight side, two straight side, three straight side. Four straight sides. So all together we have there are four straight sides. For the 3D shape, we call it straight straight edge. For the 2D shape, we call it straight side. Okay. Now we look at number two. Okay. This shape, we call it rectangle. I am rectangle. 
So how many street side that rectangle has? Okay, we count one, two, three, four. So all together, there are four straight sides. Then we look at the corner, one corner, two corner, three corner, four corner. So there are four corners. The square and the rectangle have the same character. They have four straight sides and four corners. Okay, girls. Okay, now we proceed to the next shape. Okay, good. Okay, this is the next shape. Okay, this is we call triangle. Same thing, we have corners, we have straight sides. So we want to count how many straight sides that the triangle has. One. Two, three. So there are three straight sides. How about the corner, the sharp one, the pointed one? One, two, three. So there are three corners for the triangle. Okay, the last shape. What is the last shape? We have four to the shape all together. Okay, this is the last sheet for you. Okay, this is called circle. I am circle. Okay, the circle has only one curved side. Why is it one? Okay, for example, when you start from here, you make the circle, the curved side here, and you meet again at the same point. So there are only one curved side. Okay, how many straight side the circle has? Okay, zero straight side. Okay, the circle don't have any straight side. Okay, how many corners the circle has? Is there any corners here? Yes, we don't have, uh, the circle don't have any corners. So, zero corner. Okay, is that clear? Okay, very good. Okay, we move to the next one. Keep it for a while. So now we want to look at the 2D shapes pattern. Okay, what is the pattern? The pattern is the shapes that are arranged repeatedly. Okay, the shape is arranged again and again, then it will form the pattern. The beautiful pattern. Okay, now look at the first pattern here. We start with the triangle. The next one is rectangle. Triangle, rectangle. Triangle, rectangle. Triangle, and the last one is rectangle. Okay, so this one, we make some correction here. This one is not square, okay? This one is rectangles. Rectangles. Okay, triangles and rectangles are arranged repeatedly. Okay, how about the second pattern? We start with square, circle, triangle. Square, circle, triangle. And it repeat, repeat again and again. Okay, so this is the pattern. Three, three shape. Then repeat again the same three shape. Repeat again the set of the three D of the two D shape. Okay, you also can create your own pattern using the two D shape. You can arrange any two D shape pattern that you like. Then you will form um, the decoration. Okay. Okay. Now we move to the next one. Okay. So now. Here's other activities, the exercise for you. Okay, so what are you going to do after this is you need to open your activity book and then 
and we want and you need to do the exercise this one is your activity book okay you need you need to do the exercise on page 72 73 74 75 okay okay don't forget to complete your work and send to me for checking okay girls okay sorry we don't have any uh, voice chat session for today because all the teachers need to be at school so okay if you have any problem you can you can ask me personally okay okay thank you class thank you for watching goodbye